Good morning and a very warm welcome to our community meditation. So wonderful to meditate together with you all. I'd like to begin with a few stretches. So just start with a nice natural stretch. I don't know if you're in your bed or you made it out of your bed, but either way, having a nice stretch as if you're just waking up in the morning. That always feels good. It's like a wake up stretch. And maybe just giving your jaw a little bit of a wiggle, just loosening up the any tension that might be there, raising and lowering your eyebrows. And then just gently rolling your shoulders in one direction, feeling into the sensations. Remember, if you don't feel like it, or you don't want to do it, or you can't do it, you can just visualize. And if you don't want to visualize, you can just practice however you wish. If you can't do the movements, I read that visualizing helps to stimulate those muscles and the connection between your brain and the muscles. So sometimes it can help. And giving your hands a bit of a shake and opening and closing your hands and your arms, just bringing a sense of aliveness. And then gently moving your head. So your left ear is leaning down towards your left shoulder. And then rolling around. So your chin goes towards your chest. Feeling the stretch in the back of your neck. Taking a breath here and continuing to roll around. So your right ear it's kind of pointing towards your right shoulder and there's a nice stretch in the left side of your neck. Just gently relaxing your face. A little 1% smile. Feeling your breath down in your belly if you can. And then just rolling the head around again so your chin is going back towards your chest. <coughs> And then your left ear is going back towards your left shoulder. And then just straightening up again. And maybe just gently raising your shoulders up towards your ears, if you enjoy that, and squeezing the shoulders. And as you breathe out, just letting them drop down and back and they may relax a bit and release a bit. That sense of letting go of the weight from your shoulders, raising your shoulders gently. And then letting them drop. Now I'm really getting into this mindful cream. <laughs> so imagine you've got some of this nice cream and it's got the word mindfulness on it and any other qualities you want to cultivate today. Do you want to cultivate a bit of relaxation or peace or self-care, curiosity, ease? What do you want? What, what quality do you want to cultivate? And I'm going to press the button here and now you've automatically all got some of that nice cream in your hand or a nice pot of cream anyway. And so you can take a bit of that. Just rub it in your hands and into your fingers and thumbs. And then taking a bit more of that cream and just massaging it into your face, starting with your forehead, feeling the sensations, smoothing out your forehead. into your temples, just massaging it in. Allow yourself to luxuriate in the feeling, to enjoy the feeling. 
and then just bang your two fingers, the center of your eyebrows, and then just moving outwards on both sides. That can feel nice. Center of the eyebrows, and then just pushing outwards. And you can do the same underneath the eyes. That feels really, feels good to me anyway. Hopefully it feels good for you. Do that a few times, maybe two or three times. And check your nose is clear and you can put a bit of this cream into the nose and imagine it penetrating into your skin and going into your being, your mind, your heart. Is it the self-care cream? Is it the peace cream? PC, peace cream. <laughs> and then down into your cheeks and your jaw muscles. And then round to the back of your neck. You could just take one hand and squeeze the back of the neck. Or you can use your two hands with the fingers and just roll it down the back of your neck if you can. Then down into your shoulders. I especially like to massage into that, that connection between the neck and the shoulders. But as I say, Practice in a way that works for you. You may even like to just go down both arms using one hand. And then, you, and then maybe using your thumb, if you can, onto one palm of the hand and just massaging into the palm of the other hand. For example, your right thumb massaging into your left palm. It feels really good for me when I kind of just in the center of the palm, just a little bit lower, I just press gently there, or massage there with the thumb. I think I'm sure there's some kind of acu pressure point there. And then same on the other side, left thumb on the right palm, perhaps for you between the center of the palm and the base of the thumb. Somehow feels good there. You find where it works for you. Wonderful. And maybe just finish with one or two stretches. So just shaking it out and then a deep breath in as you raise your arms up above your head. Stretching to the stars in the sky. Relaxing your face, and as you breathe out, arms coming down. Maybe one more. And as you do so, try and breathe down into the base of your lungs, breathing in deeply. Arms coming up. And slow, smooth breath. as the arms come down. That's excellent. So now you've done your daily workout as well. <laughs> so place your hands in your in a place that feels good for your meditation. And let's just take a few moments to notice the sensations in the body and make small adjustments so it feels even more comfortable for you. So let's take a minute or so to do that.
feeling into the sensations in the body with the quality you wish to cultivate, so with awareness and kindness or care. Knowing that as soon as you feel the sensation in the body, you're taking a step into the here and now, the present moment. Even one second of mindfulness is valuable. Who knows what that will need to. So as best you can, feeling the sensations in your body, in your back, in your face, in your legs. And just noticing what it feels like to feel those sensations. Every day is unique and different. And this particular moment will never be the same again. So see if you can value this moment. From time to time, I'll remind you of this tiny smile as you meditate to consciously, in a very, very small way, lift the corners of the mouth, no matter how you feel. Maybe that's the only posture that's important. It starts to open up your awareness and open up the warmth to yourself and others.
sign by ET. Imagine as you're meditating right now that you've been given a seed of mindfulness and kindness. We can call it kindfulness. And somehow the seed has been given to you and you put that seed in some soil. And every day you put at least a drop of water. And a drop of water represents a moment of mindfulness, a few seconds. One conscious breath, for example, or feeling your feet on the floor or noticing the clouds or the sky. And every day you put at least a drop. And the seed of kindfulness one day germinates and sprouts and you get this little seedling, a seedling of kindfulness. And every day you put another drop of water and that's all it needs. Some days you manage more, some days a bit less, but generally speaking, you put at least a drop a day and it grows bigger and bigger. You need to put it into a bigger pot and it continues to grow. Every day you water it, at least a drop. And you enjoy seeing it grow, so sometimes you give it more than a drop. And this seedling of kindfulness becomes into a plant and it's ready to be planted outside in the ground. So imagine the joy as you dig a hole and you plant this plant outside in the ground. You continue to water it. You know you need to give it at least a drop because you remember you used to but when you go to give it a drop, usually you feel like giving more than just a drop. And so every day you water this seed, which is now growing to become a wonderful tree, your favorite tree, your tree of kindfulness. Imagine what it would feel like to look at that tree every day. And of course, this little seed that you're watering is within you. And we're doing it right now. When you feel your body, when you feel your breathing, when you do a tiny 1% smile, when you do a small act of kindness, that's watering the seed of kindfulness within you. So I invite you to imagine you're sitting by this tree 
and practicing your meditation today with this kindfulness tree. And you enjoy looking at its trunk, and its branches and its leaves. Take a few moments to practice your meditation as you spend time with this tree. You notice that this tree doesn't seem to mind if it's a nice sunny day or if it's really windy and rainy. Its trunk is stable because it's got deep roots that go down into the earth. And so if you wish, you can merge with this tree, become one with the tree. Because this tree is something you are watering within you. And you can imagine that you have these deep roots that go down deep into the earth as you sit or lie here. And you've got this beautiful trunk imperfect and beautiful. Maybe that can represent your body. And you've got these wonderful branches. And leaves and fruit. And so you've got this flexibility in your branches, swaying in the wind. And you've got the rootedness, you're rooted in the earth, you're rooted in awareness.
And so as we come towards the end of this meditation, remember this tree came from a tiny seed and just a drop of water a day. And so I invite you to practice for a drop or a moment every day. More if you want to. One deep breath, one tiny smile. Maybe joining this community for just a few seconds and then more if you want to, and that's watering the seed. <laughs>